Hi, my name is Rafael Betancourt, I'm a professional baseball player, and today I'm going to talk about the grip on my fastball. Um, the first things I'll, I try to do, I throw a four seam fastball, used to get my fingers on top of the seam like this, and that way, um, because you don't see, when you're pitching, you don't see the ball, you just get the feeling of the seams, and then, um, when I'm ready to throw the ball, I just try to f get that feeling when the ball's coming out of my hand, you know, I feel that in, in, in the tip of my fingers, like the seam of the baseball. And that make the ball get a bit of light when it's gone to the plate. And um, this, you know, this is a pitch I threw most of the time. Um, I'm a fastball pitcher. And, and that's why I always try to, you know, to work in that every day. and and see where I feel a better grip in, in the baseball. And, you know, sometimes hitters know the ball's, um, fastball's coming, but um, you, you don't have to be afraid of that. Uh, if it's the best pitch, you have to be, you have to have confidence and be very aggressive, and you're only gonna get a guy out with that pitch. And, um, and also, very important when you do that, when you throw the fastball, you need to be in top of the baseball. Like, when I'm talking about top is when you throw the ball, you have to be able to get in front of the baseball like this, and that way, when the ball's coming out of your hand, you get that feeling like it's, it's going to be a very good pitch. And uh, there's, um, you know, other stuff like um, to throw strides. You, you you have to be able to to throw a lot of strides, especially when you're pitching in the big leagues. And that's something that helped me, you know, a lot. And also. Um, be aggressive with you know any hitters can be a lead off hitter or a, a, a clean up and when you do that you're going to be a very successful feature in the big leagues be able to throw your fast or false right and be able to to get a lot of confidence in that pitch okay something when you um throw on the uh, base hole especially your fast hole uh, try not to put the ball all the way in in your palm like this because that way you don't going to have any um I think release point is going to be bad doing that. You have to be able to put your fingers on top of the seam and hold with your tongue like this. Um, that way it's going to make you throw the ball harder and, you know, and, and get more light in, in the fastball. I mean, it, that way to pull the ball all the way in your hands like this is not a good idea to do it. And, uh, but use the pain how the kid is. If you're a, a little kid, you know, sometimes your hands are not big to do that. But when you're getting older, that's the way you have to do it. You try to hold both with, um, with your fingers on top of the seam, and the, and the tongue is going to be in the bottom right this. And that way, when you throw the ball, it's going to be easy for you to, you know, to get a good release point, too. Thank you. I'm Rafael Betancourt, a professional baseball player, and this is what I, the grip I have for my uh, fastball. <laughs>